Japan's leadership in supercomputing has been revived. In November 2010, the Tokyo Institute of Technology, Tokyo Tech, developed and deployed the first ever multi petaflop supercomputer in Japan. The system is called Tsubame 2.0, successor to the highly successful Tsubame 1. Tsubame stands for the Tokyo Tech Supercomputer and ubiquitously mass storage environment. Tsubame in Japanese is a swallow, which is also a symbol of our university. In 2006, we developed the supercomputer called Tsubame. According to the top 500 list, Tsubame 1 was ranked 4 consecutive times as the fastest supercomputer in Japan and achieved seven consecutive performance improvements literally symbolizing Tokyo Tech with its continuous evolution over the years. In 2010, a new version of Tsubame, Tsubame 2.0, was developed with overwhelming advances in computational performance as well as enabling other innovations. This is the result of global collaborative design and development with a number of world-renowned vendors partnering with Tokyo Tech to offer their skills and their latest technologies. Tsubame 2.0 was developed to combine scalar processing of industry standard CPUs with vector processing of industry leading GPUs in a so called hybrid architecture, especially tailored for large scale supercomputing. A total of 1,442 computing nodes achieve 2.4 petaflops peak performance or 2,400 trillion floating point calculations per second, one of the world's top computing capabilities. This is about 30 times speed up over Tsubame 1 in just four and a half years, and exceeds the combined peak performances of all the existing supercomputers in Japan circa 2010. Tsubame 2.0 is not merely an array of computing nodes equipped with high performance GPUs. It was architected with high bandwidth memory and high speed network interconnects in order to effectively provide data to the GPUs. Tsubame 1 exhibited only 17 terabytes per second of effective aggregate memory bandwidth, while Tsubame 2.0 exhibits over 700 terabytes per second, a factor of over 40 improvement. Each computing node is connected to a high-speed optical network that is 80 times faster than gigabit Ethernet on high-end PCs. The entire Tsubame 2.0 facilitates one of the world's fastest so-called full bisection optical network, whose performance at 200 terabit per second allows all the nodes to communicate simultaneously without congestion. The combination of all these architectural elements completes the first petaflops supercomputer in Japan with 2.4 petaflops of computational capability. Massive storage with extreme high speed access is also very important. Tsubame 2.0's hierarchical storage capacity is over 11 petabytes, or more than 10 times that of Tsubame 1. Tsubame 2.0 provides hierarchical storage volumes. The first level is a total of 190 terabytes of SSDs embedded in computing nodes as scratch spaces, providing ultra-fast 2,000 terabytes per second I.O. bandwidth. The second level is the six petabytes of parallel file systems, such as raster, allowing extremely fast access to petabyte scale data, in addition to the 1.2 petabytes of home storage volume for providing campus cloud services as everyone's supercomputer. The third level is four petabytes of tape library storage, bringing the total storage capacity is up to 11 petabytes being the largest storage capacity by far of all Japanese supercomputing centers.
Amend scaling and the complexity of modern-day supercomputers today pose not only high administrative costs, but also a tremendous carbon footprint due to significant power consumption. Tsubame 2.0 is employing various technologies to become the smallest and greenest petascale supercomputer in the world. Tsubame 2.0 is already highly attractive due to its petascale computational performance. Additionally, high computational power of GPUs allow for extremely high density in its packaging. Tsubame 2.0 occupies only two-thirds footprint of Tsubame 1. As for power, compared to Tsubame 1, which consumed approximately one megawatt under normal operation, Tsubame 2.0 consumes only slightly higher, despite factor 30 boost in performance. In addition, we employ the latest rack-contained water cooling system with a built-in heat exchanger allowing the high-density racks to be cooled effectively with completely automated control to minimize power consumption. The measure of effectiveness of cooling, the PUE, will improve from Tsubame 1's 1.44 to 1.28, achieving likely the number one cooling efficiency of all Japanese supercomputers.